So our last one here from Cheltenham, race 21, it's the Midlands Point Hunter Chase. It's a 0 to 100 event. So Banco for Martin Leadham, Bun Ratty for Daniel French, Parts Front for Paul O'Neill, Copycat Ball for Alex Cherry along with Glenn Dew, Hollywood Leg End for Derek Hinton, Lom Loma Pamar Blaze, Blaze for Ryan Costello and Sayadere Classical for James Shea. It's a favourite, probably not the best form in the race. Not many of these have, they're all uh, well rated under 100. It's a two mile one event, they're away. And they're going to be led by, looks like, Copycat Ball and Holly Woodleg End. And pushing through now is Banco. As we wait for it to settle, we've got about 14 uh, fences to take there over the first. We'll take it well. And it is Copycat Ball from Holly Woodleg End. Banco in third. We get to the second of 14, they all jump it well. All bar and Loma Pamar Blaze. Uh, didn't take it well, shuffled himself uh, to about three lengths off the chasing pack. Although there's probably only uh, ten lengths between the first and last at the moment. All bar, Lom up and our blaze. All oh, the leader went through the top of their copycat board, shuffles back down through the pack and allowed Holly Woodleg End to be out on his own on his front when they go over the fourth. Although uh, over this hunter chase, the Midlands point hunters chase. It's Hollywood leg end and copycat ball. Followed through by Glendew and Banco. And Parks front and Sayadere classic on the favourite. The one's dropping right back towards the where is Daniel French's Bun Ratty. And good old Ryan Costello's a long up a mile blaze. We've got right on board now, Glendew. Approach the next, which will be the fifth. It's going to be his teammate in front of him, copycat ball. The leaders are over it as well as him. Fast jump there, and as you can see, jumped alongside uh, Hollywood Leg End. We've had a few of the horses now. And on Dell's horse, Hollywood Leg End takes the water, gets over it well. And it's Copycat Ball that just leads him by a length and a half. And stable mate Glenn Dew and Banco Parks front and Sadia Classic out. All within touch, but Matty's got a bit closer now. And there's a Loma Pamar Blaze. Oh, they've come down to a mile from home as they go uphill now. The uphill fence, all over it. Bit of a poor jump by Glenn Dew. Shuffles him back down. But with a mile to travel, it's Hollywood Leg End and Copy Gap Ball as they get to the top of the course and start their downward run. Made by a couple of lengths to Banco against the fence again over the big ditch, the ninth, although Hollywood Leg End didn't take it well. And we did Glenn Dew towards the rear. And the plum ride is Sayadir Classical on Banco. Park's front hasn't done a lot, so you go over the tenth. Big Plenty of air there from Copycat Ball, the leader. We swing left handed past the oak tree. And it is Copycat Ball from Hollywood Egg Leg End. Parks front. Banco moving well now on the outside. is Sayadir Classic out. We get to the 11th. Oh, the leader went straight through it. And it's, uh, everybody's drawn alongside now. It's Copycat Ball and Sayadir Classic all from Hollywood Leg End and Banco. Bum Ratty's come from nowhere and running on really well now. Glenn Dew's having a little bit of a go. Parks Front's not done anything yet as they get to the 12th. They need two to jump. Parks Front didn't jump it well. He's unseated his rider. Something has gone wrong there as he slipped back down the pack. But it's Sayadir Classical that leads us inside the half mile now. And it's Sayadir Classical from Copycat Ball running well out of the pack now. Is Glenn Dew. Also on the outside is Bum Ratty. So take this slight left dog hand, dog leg bend, and it's Sayadir classical that just takes it up from copycat ball there's only going to be two to jump and it's sad here classical it's going to lead them into the penultimate gets over it well we're inside the final quarter and it's sad here classical bum ratty in second copycat ball just drifts backwards banco running on he gets over the last they're all over it but it's sad here classical he's got about four or five length advantage he was the full horse in this race coming up the hill now running on well is banco and bum ratty are they going to catch him sad here classical better keep an eye out but it's sad here classical from banco and bum ratty they might catch him on the line here. Is he going to come in time? It's Sayadir Classical just hangs on from Banco and Bum Ratty ganging up on him to try and take it. But the line came in time. So it's a win for Sayadir Classical and James Shea. Well done. And Martin Leedham and Daniel French fought out second and third there. It's Banco for Martin Leedham was second. Bum Ratty for Daniel French was third. Fourth was Glenn Dew for Alex Jerry. And fifth was Holly Woodleg End for Derek Hinton.